Let's go, Arcs finally involved. TBF Gaming jumping back into our Elemental Arc playthrough. Excited to get going today. We're working on a couple things. The main focus today is going to be turning these little baby hatchlings into the big dragon. We're going to try and get through the actual process today, all the way through it. So it might take a little while. It, this video is going to definitely be late. We're recording this about an hour before it's supposed to come out, and it's definitely not going to make it out on time. So hopefully we'll get it out within the next couple hours and have a decent video today. But I hope you guys enjoy it. Like, comment, subscribe. Huge shout out to the patrons for making these servers possible. Huge shout out to you for checking this video out. Let's go. So we've got a lot to do. So let's get this done. So we're, basically we're going to take these little hatchlings to the dragons, and then whatever form is after this, we're going to see that today. So that's the big goal. I think we get a hybrid dragon out of it, I think, is what we're going to get at the end of this. But it's been a while since I've done it. So basically the way this works is you have the boss fights in this mod, right? You have the Incarnates, which is a little boss Straboa. And then the second tier is the Avengers. You make this little lure right here, which is a Avenger lure. This brings in a big dragon of whatever elemental type. So this is a water one. So if we put this water one down, we'd have to fight a water Avenger right here on the roof. Probably not a good idea. But you fight the Water Avenger with whatever dino is strong against that. When you defeat it, you get an egg. That egg gives you a hatchling. That hatchling then wants to grow into a full, like, or into the second stage of this little dragon thing. In order to do that, basically all you have to do is put a wyvern of the same affinity in front of these guys. So I've got little nature poison wyverns over here. So we're going to put a poison wyvern right in front of them. Boom. Boom. And now these guys back here will start gaining affinity if they haven't already. Oh, they already, they're already ready to go. Look at that. So then you come up to these guys. Once they have that little fist above their head, see the little fist? Instead of the 0%, they have the fist. So now we come over here, we hold E, and we tell this guy to grow. So he's now going to grow into a, a second stage, which looks like the little dragon. So that's basically how that works. Very, very simple. But you, now these wyverns, you just get them from out, out in the wild. You find eggs out in the wild, and then you hatch them just like a normal wyvern. They're very cool, but they're just they're just like your basic wyvern. So they basically train the little guys. Apparently, you can use rock drakes or the actual wyvern, so it's kind of important to know. But we'll wait 30 seconds for this guy to hatch out, and then we'll go ahead and show you what the second tier looks like. And then we're going to take these guys out and level them up for the next stage. So this is basically stage one. So there you go. Fight the boss get a hatchling, hatch the hatchling, and then train the hatchling with his big wyvern brother, and then eventually we go to the second stage, like that over there, and we'll explain that in just a second. Let's get these last 17 seconds out of the way. But man, this has been a really fun playthrough. Elemental Arc, huge shout out to the mod devs for this one. This has been a really, really fun playthrough. we got a lot of work to do. There's a bunch of other things we want to do to get this playthrough done. we got an Arc Omega server. We have a, a Primal Fear server, Eternal Primal Fear that I didn't finish. There's so many things. Okay, hold on. Stay right there. So now you can see it's now that kind of dragon. Now, in order to level it up from here, you have to match it up with its, basically, its, its, its elemental counterpart. So for that, a good way to think of it is to go look at our other guys over here. So we have, like, this guy right here. Our, let's go with the fen, right? The fen is a nature and water combined. So nature and water combines in the fen. Or the other guy over here, the, what is it, vapor is fire and water and then this guy is stone and ice something like that so each one is like a combination to make them into these the hybrids and that's basically what we're working with here is we want to put two of the dragons together that work well with each other so we have the water guy water hatchling and we have the poison hatchling you you basically put these guys together you take them out and you level them up when they level up I'm not, I'm sorry, not when they level up, but when they get these little things inside of them, the catalyst, they need 100 of this resource inside, and then apparently you can grow them after that. So that's what we're trying to do, is get them to where they have 100 of this little essence inside of them, and they get this essence by attacking things with their buddies. We got both these here. I did give them about six or seven of the experience potions that we've gotten from drops, so we gave them a bunch of experience potions. So now we're going to go, we're going to go mainly health, because I just don't want these guys to die. So I'm going to go like 13 health on this guy, and then the rest melee. And then we'll use our, that's 67 health, that's way better. And then we're going to use our otter to go ahead and get them all healed up. Uh, same thing on this guy, let's go like 19 into health. There you go, just to make sure. These guys are kind of low level, not great levels, but they, they'll be halfway okay once we get them evolved. There we go. All right, cool. Go ahead and get you over here. If I put you guys right next to each other, hopefully you'll just land and stay here. There we go. I also did go ahead and put trackers on almost everything. I know you guys remind me of this all the time. It's one of my biggest like things that I forget all the time. But but we always forget trackers. But I've got trackers on almost all my important dinos. I got it on Medic. I got it on Mossy. I've got it on all of our Golems and our Thyla, I think. I all have one now. So let's go ahead and get these guys healed up with our buddy Medic. Medic's probably going to pass out because this is pretty hard work healing these dinos up. 
We're going to get them all healed up. And then we'll take these guys out to the desert, probably. Uh, you got, got to kind of figure out what you want to do with it. Because water is strong against fire, but fire can wreck nature, if I remember right. So we do have to be a little bit careful. Man, poor water hatchling. 33,000 compared to year 70. Whew. All right. You guys feeling good now? There we go. All right. Also, hold on. I'm noticing. I saw these guys have elemental flame. So this guy, his little thing is rubbing off on them. Let me see. Does it work when I'm holding him? It does. So they are getting the they're getting the buff from my little pug. That's great news. So they'll actually get a little bit of a damage buff. This little tiny pug basically gives you a Did I not throw him down? Hold on. There you go. This little pug gives a fire buff. You can see it on my bottom right. Your attack has been boosted by a friendly elemental. Very, very cool. All right. How are you feeling, buddy? Are you going to knock out? You really, you're really, you definitely going to knock out. Do I have like a poison eraser? Let me see if there's an eraser here. Poison or tor torpor? Maybe torpor? Hmm. Eraser. Stam. Hold on. Let's just look at all potions. That's probably a better idea. Potions. There's so many of them. Dino imprint. Dino food. Dino health. Dino instantane. That's awesome. I didn't know about that one. It's expensive, but that's doable. Uh, what's this one? Dino level potion. Reset all stats and level it to maximum. <gasps> that's a thing? Oh, wow. I didn't know about that. Can I make one? What would we need? Two mind wipe tonics? We're about to do that. Uh, gender change. Hair grow. Suicide potion. No, we don't need that. Health potion and remate potion. Interesting. Very, very interesting. So we we want to do this. The level potion. I didn't know about this. So if I make some mind wipe tonics, which I should somewhere. Do I not have... Hold on, let's get the cauldron made. We'll make a cauldron real quick. We'll get this done. We'll get them all the way to maximum. That way we can actually... We just need one. Boom. We'll get them all the way to max. That way we can actually make sure they have their like full stats. Because I don't know when you evolve them, if their levels carry on or not. That's actually a really, really interesting. I need to test this. Hold on. Let's test this. So I need to make three of these things. Let's go ahead and put this down. Uh, here we go. Boom. So I'll turn that on. And I need to make a mind wipe times three now. So for that, I need cooked prime meat times 60 something and a bunch of narcotic. Okay. Well, we can get, we can do this. Okay. Raw prime meat. Oh, we got plenty of that. One, two, three, four, five. Boom. Cook a bunch of that for me. We need more for trackers anyway. And then narcotic. Hopefully we can make narcotic. If not, we'll go on a quick berry run. All right, three, two, one of those. Boom. Oh, no, we got it all, man. Wow. I'm always confused when everything actually works out. Now, this has been a, a huge help. Otto helped out with a bunch of this for the gathering. So without him, I wouldn't have been able to get this far. So huge shout out to him for that. He did a lot of work on this server, and I really do appreciate it. Uh, working in the tribe always makes it a lot easier. We will do a solo playthrough in the near future. I know some people want to see more solo stuff, so I, I slow down and kind of show the stump, stuff off. But, man, playing multiplayer is so much more fun. So it, it just depends. We'll kind of see. All right, let's go all the meat and all the wipe. Need three of them. Need 18 more narcotic and a little bit of stimulant. Okay. All right. Narcotics coming up. Stimulants coming up. Boom. Hopefully I can make three of them with this. That and that. Let's go unsort so that fixes. And then we need... White potion one more time. There you go. There's three of these guys. Perfect. And then we go over here. And then we can make this level potion. Okay. Can I search it by level? Ah, we can. Level times three. Boom. Oh, that's awesome. How long does it take to craft? Is it slow? No, it's going okay. All right. So we'll get three of these made up. This is actually perfect. So while that's making up the other two, let's go test it on a guy up here. What I want to do is, if I level him and then evolve him, does he keep his levels? Because that would allow us to finally get a high-level dragon, because since we're struggling with levels so much. This is always, every mod's a little bit different with whether or not dinos carry on their levels, so this is a really good test. All right, so let's take this guy, for example, level 62 or 82, 82 back here. So this level 82. All right, if I gave him this potion. Oh, look, he's got, oh, they get affinity tokens on them. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that's what happens. All right, so if I give him this, boom, 
He's got his 88 levels, and we'll just put it into whatever, right? Because we're going to evolve him, so it doesn't really matter. We just put it all into one stat, and then we evolve him. Does he keep his levels? That's all we want to know. Please keep your levels. Okay, so now, instead of that little low level, he's a one... I'm sorry, I can't see it. Hold on. I can't see it. Undo, undo. Now he's a level... Why can't I see it? Hmm. Did I pump the wrong one? Oh, there he is. He's a level 170 now. So now, if we grow this guy, are you going to turn into a higher level? There you go, man. We'll come back up and check him out in just a second. Let's go ahead and get our guys. Because regardless, we still want to level these guys up just to give them as much melee and health as we can. Okay, so now let's get these other two potions. That's awesome, man. I didn't know about this potion. It's a little expensive, but definitely, definitely worth it. All right. Get these two potions. Look at all the stuff on there. So much stuff. All right. Throw this on our friends over here. Boom. Boom. And then same on you. Boom and boom. All right. Now they've got all the levels. So I can put like 40 levels in here and 40 levels in melee and then be good to go. Unfortunately, we'll have to reheal them. That's fine. Let's go like that. 40 and... Bunch into melee. Don't put any into movement speed. These guys are already too fast. There you go. 74,000. Way better. And this guy will be pretty good. He'll be 188. So we'll go 40 points here. Uh-oh. I hear my guy flying up top. Hopefully we don't lose him. Oh, I put too many? That's fine. I think that says 179,000. And he's up to level 188. Boom. Now you, can I put you on auto heal? Enable auto healing. Do the thing, buddy. Heal, buddy, heal. Do you need food? Oh, there you go. You're doing the thing. All right. Okay, you just keep healing them. We need it. And we can go... What is it? A... Was it food? I think there's a food potion. I just need one food potion. Just to make sure this guy has full food. Boom. There you go. Get that good eat. Perfect. All right, now his food is full. Now he'll hopefully he'll finish healing those guys. Okay, let's go check out that guy on the roof. I want to see if he kept his levels or not. I also hopefully didn't fly away on us. And then we can go out and get these guys leveled up. So there you go. A nice little quick process today. Uh, I hear him flapping. Oh, is that Tim right there? He kept his levels. Boom. Okay, that's huge news. That is actually really cool. So we can actually take him with us. Uh, oh, we can't we can't ball him up. Okay, let's go. Whistle land. Land. There you go. What's up, little buddy? Do I have a tracker for you? Because we can level you up too. We get a couple of these guys. Tracker. Boom. There you go. Now we have a tracker on the second one. And maybe do another water guy. If we had like four of them together, would they level up faster? Uh, that's a frost. I thought that was a water. That is a... That's also a frost. I don't have any other water, guys? Dang, okay. Alright, well, it seemed like a good idea. We might still... Oh, no! Oh, I missed that. Okay, my bad. <laughs> let's go back up. My bad. Alright, yeah. That, that'll work. Okay, let's go get our guys. Let's finally go out. Let me make sure they're healed up, and we're gonna go out and level these guys up. I know it's a little ways into the video, but we gotta kinda go through this whole process with you guys. Let me show all of it. To include all of our mistakes, right? Alright, hopefully they are at least somewhat healed up. Uh, doing pretty good. Good job, man. Let's get him again. Hit him one more time. Good job, Medic. You're doing good things, Medic. Alright, hopefully while we have you balled up, you go ahead and get better. You guys we can't pick up. Let's jump on Mossy. And let's go. We're going to go all the way now out to... I think the desert's a good spot just because it's so wide open. We're going to go there just it makes it easier. These guys are such a pain to get to attack things. So I think this is a good spot. All right. Uh, there we go. We'll get down here and then we'll bring these guys in. Where's a good spot for these guys? Hopefully it's not anywhere near nighttime either. Uh, here we go. Let's start right here. Okay. So we'll bring in Poison Hatchling. And 
water hatchling. There we go. Oh, no. My bad. I knocked him out. That was actually not intentional. <laughs> uh, okay, don't knock out your friends. Hopefully you don't do that. Okay, we'll pick up Mossy for right now. Okay. There you go. Oh, that's good damage. And then that should... Oh, oh, what's happening? Okay. I don't know what was going on. So that should have gave them just a little bit. Yep, we're up to 27 Catalyst and 27 Catalyst. So it does kind of keep track with the two of them. So, okay. You guys stay here for like just a second. I want this guy to come over here. Oh, that might knock him out. Hold on, don't do that. What are you doing? Are you coming to attack me? Oh, I thought he was coming to attack me. I was like, what? Okay, come here, turtle. I need the turtle to come over here and get eaten. I know. I, I'm sorry, little turtle chibi. We got to do it, man. There you go. So we'll go like this. There you go. Eat his face. Nice. So how much did that give you? So two. So basically... Whoa, 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 guys. Where are they... What are you guys doing? I love that you're walking around now. That's great. Okay. Super weird. Okay, we'll just let, let you do your thing. Basically, I think teleporting them in like this is the way to go. <laughs> it feels like the way to go for this. Let's go... Poison and water... There you go. Come here, little Dillo guy. Ow. There you go. So is it going to be literally two every single time? No, we only got one for that. Okay. Oh, my God. So they're going to keep running off, though. It is daytime, though. So at least we're... I think we got plenty of time to get this done. We just need... All of these dinos in the same spot. Let's see. There you go. Eat their faces, please. Good job. Yeah, we definitely need, like, bigger dinos for sure. Okay, we're going, though. It's just going to take a while. This is going to be a process. If we can get maybe, like, a bigger dino, this would be way better. Uh, Why are you sitting like that? I don't know. I would love a little Dimorphodon army. I didn't even work on those this season. Okay, well, let's go. Let's jump on Mossy again here. In fact, you know what? Actually, let's jump on, let's jump on Medic. Because that way, if I right-click with Medic, it's it's just going to heal. It's not going to knock things out. All right. We'll run way over here. We'll bring our little dragons in. They can wreck all these guys. What's up, snakes? I think the snakes, that's a perfect target. Okay. So we'll go like that. Poison. And like that. Water. All right. Snakes. Where'd you go? Snakes. How do you always follow me except for the one time I need you to? Snake. Oh, yep. Got it. Got his attention. Oh, jeez. I got his attention too much. Oh, I hate snakes. Hate, hate, hate. Okay, come on. Come on. Ah, it's too far away. <laughs> it's way too far away. Oh, there we go. What is this guy? Eat their faces. Good job. Eat their face. This guy, too. Why do my wyverns keep running away? There you go. Run back. There you go. Eat his face. <laughs> I'm not sure what's going on with the whole run away thing, but other than that, they're doing great. All right. We're all the way up to 35. It's not going as quick as I would hope. If we, we need, like, maybe we need to go to a better zone. How would ice do? Maybe ice would be a good idea. Black pearls. Okay, there's definitely a bunch of dinos up here. And I don't think it matters what kind of dinos. We could attack a bunch of the Crystal Isle ones, I think. All right. Fingers crossed. Hopefully we can. Oh, I forgot how dark and awful this place is. It's not nighttime, is it? Nope, this place just is garbage. I, I've never liked this island just because of that. The, the vision is just bad. Okay, yep. I need to jump on before we hit the ground this time. Ready, jump. Okay, I know, I know. Let's heal up. Okay, we're going to get up here, and then we'll bring our guys in. Yeah, just the anywhere that does like this to your lighting, never a fan. All right. Is there some stuff up here? Well, liquefied wrecks. That sounds like a good idea. Okay. We're going to bring in poison. Bring in water. All right, guys. Don't take off. Don't take off. Oh, no, I want them to stay on the ground. 
Come on. Stay on the ground. Yep, that's happening. Okay. We're going to end up losing them for like hours. Okay. Poison and water. There they go. Are they attacking this guy? That's fine. I'm good with that. There you go. Both of you attack that guy. Come on, guys. Get him. There you go. Poison Hatchling killed the Rex. There you go. Everybody heal. Hopefully they're getting some levels out of this. Although, we're going to have to check and make sure they're actually getting levels. If this isn't something where they don't get levels because it's not elemental, I'm going to be really sad. We'll know really soon. I didn't know we get element shard for this. That's kind of awesome. Okay. Do we get... Um, 46. So it looks like we do. Oh, man. Okay. So if we can attack some of these guys, we might be able to get this done kind of quickly. Okay. You guys need to wreck the, wreck the Stego real quick. There you go. Get him, guys. Get him, get him, get him. Good job. There we go. Now we're doing things. Plus, we're getting element shards out of this. That's never a bad thing. Doing great. Let's go eat a couple Brontos. Come on, guys. Go get them. All right. I see one. I see two. There you go. Both going in. Hopefully, the size of the dino gives me more. That'd be great. There's one down. All right. Go get the other one. And then we'll check their inventory as soon as they finish this one. There you go. Good job. Uh, he dropped some stuff for us. Okay. Where are we at now? Oh, let's get it done. We're at 61. Oh, we're going to get this done, guys. This is going to be great. This is going to finally be the way. So this is like the best place to go so far. Hopefully we can find some more Brontos. That works out great. Plus, we get good supplies out of this. This has actually been really good. Oh, there's more Brontos. Oh, we got a couple guys coming in. Okay, good job, good job. I'm going to go hit this guy, too. We don't get too far away. Oh, got a raptor in. Where's the raptor? There he is. So I think as long as they're close to each other, as long as either one of them gets the kill, is how it works, or do they have to attack at the same time? I'm not really sure. Okay, you guys, go get the big guys. There's one. Where's the other guy? There you go. Both of you in there. We got a couple Brontos and a Rex here. This might get us really close to the finish. There you go. All the things. All the things. Oh, you guys are killing it. Good job. Finish them off. Everybody's okay health-wise. Hopefully. Right, we'll heal a little bit. Okay. Killed something. It's kind of a bad area. Hopefully no one dies. No one die. Okay, that guy's done. Good job. Okay, come get the Rex. Get the big guy. Get this guy. Get this guy. Make sure they get the kill. And then one more big guy. And then I will check their progress. All right, fingers crossed. Oh, they wrecked him. Good job. Okay, let's get them over here. You guys almost done? Okay, here we go. Poison. He's doing his thing. Passive. Okay, one more time. Poison. And water. There we go. Make sure these guys are healed up. Oh, you guys are doing great. Okay. We are at 89. Oh, we're so close. Oh, we got this. Okay, let's go eat another Bronto. The Bronto is getting it done. Good job. We're so close to done that we can go back to base and get this get this done. Good job. Oh, I hope I didn't. Oh, no. Cinderpug got the kill. My bad. I got too close. Oh, are you guys killing something? Okay, you're killing that guy. Good job. All right, we'll give them just a little bit longer. We kill these guys. 
Yeah, there's so many dinos up here. This is actually a good spot. Doing great. Another one coming. Nice. Uh, oh, that's a, the body on, on, the, on our back. All right, finish this out, guys. You guys got this. All right, we'll let them clear this out, and then we'll... Oh, what is this? Feather light. All right, can we see... I can't see them right now, but I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to guess that they have the stuff. We're going to go check in just a second. Okay. All right. Everybody passive. Okay. Check him real quick. We've got 100 even. Does that mean he's ready? I don't see it. Maybe they don't both have 100. Where's the other guy? I don't see... Where's our water friend? Okay. Water hatch thing. He's got... Also 100. So they both have 100. I don't see the option yet, though. So maybe we got to go a little bit higher. Okay. We're going to go a little higher. Let's see if we can go find a couple more of the Brontos to kill. And then we'll be done with this process, hopefully. Uh, it's been a good spot just because how thick it is up here. You know, we, we can go we can go fight Rock Drakes, but they, they, they hit back pretty hard. And fighting these non-elementals is actually really helping. Okay, here we go. Here's a Rex. There you go. This is what we're meant to be right here. Poison and water. There you go. Fight that guy. Good job. And we'll go down here, and there's a couple more guys down here. All right. Good job. I think right down here. You guys coming? There you go. Big group down here. We'll finish this group out. Hopefully this will be it. I'm hoping it's just 100. If it's more than that, I don't know. There you go. Make sure I don't attack. Let them just attack everything in this area. Okay. Get the big guy. Get the big guy. Are they getting him? There they go. All right. Melted him. Okay. Finish off all the little guys. We'll, we'll help out a little bit down here. Everybody's good. We got another big guy here. Get him. All right. I'm going to do this one, and then we're going to teleport back to base and see if it works. If not, I'm not sure. But if it's maybe it needs 200. But I'm fairly certain that I read 100. I could have misread for sure, but. Okay, I've got a Rex coming. We'll let him take care of that guy. Guy. Yeah, see, I wish they would stay grounded like that. That'd be great. All right, liquefied Rex. It'll take them just a second to kill that guy. <laughs> the, the little one can't hit him because he's on the ground. Okay. Let's help out a little. All right, they're melting. There you go. Nature and water doing their thing. Boom. Okay. I said we were done, but we got a couple more big ones here in the area. How can I pass these up? Just in case it needs 200. All right. Uh, rain thorn. What is that? I don't know. Okay. Got all that. We actually got a good amount of supplies through this, too. A bunch of shards. All right. Okay. Let's go ahead and whistle all stop. We'll let you guys take this guy out. And then we're going to go back to base and see if this will work now. There you go. You guys do your thing against him real quick. So quick. All right. I'm going to go back to base. Let's see if this was enough. If not, I'll do a little bit more on our own. We'll get these guys to like 200 and then try. Because otherwise, I don't know. I don't know. Because that is a lot. All right. So let's go ahead and do this. Okay. Let's go poison hatchling. Let's go water hatchling. There you go. You want to go ahead and land, buddy? Go ahead and land. Of course, you flew way away to land. Good job. Okay. Are you guys close enough now? See, I don't see a grow option. Do you have to be, like, really close to each other? Hmm. See, the fist is there, but that's a, that just means you guys are friends, right? 
But you have... You've got 100. You've got 100, so you have the stuff. Dang, modify options. Now, do we need another... Maybe you need like a, a hybrid near you? Pick all that up. If I get a hybrid near you guys, will that help? Like the there's a hybrid over here. Oh, I can just bring him over. Let's go like this. Maybe having this guy here, or do we need the wyvern over here? So if we go Finn. I don't know, I just felt like that'd be a good idea. It it seemed like it would be good. Maybe they have to be really, really close to each other. Oh, let's do this. And which one is not here? The water. Have you guys like really close? All right, let me see why this isn't working. Give me a second. Oh my god, we got it. Okay, we just had to get them really close to each other to get this to work. So let me make sure I'm still recording. We were kind of just playing with it for a minute. We got them really close, and now it actually shows. It's a 188, 113. So we want to do this guy, right? A little bit better stats. Yep. So we go E, grow with water hatchling. Boom. Now I think they combine, right? These two combine into like a bigger, better dra dragon. I think. I hope. I don't actually know. Fifty seconds. Do they both grow, or does it? Do they combine? Oh, I don't know. Well, let's pick you up, Finn. You're kind of in the way. You're in the way of the science project over here for science. Oh man, I'm excited about this one. This has been a long time in the making, and it took a long time to get it to work, and then it took a long time to level them. So that just this process has taken a long time. Now, hopefully, what I'm hoping, 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 hoping is this gives us a hybrid. And in the hybrid, I can get some essence from so we can make some of the other hybrids in the station over there. Because we really need to extract some hybrid essence, but I haven't been able to yet. So I'm hoping that this is going to be the way. 20 seconds. Oh, man, this is big. This is big time. I don't want to get too close. It'll be a, a, a Fen or what is it? Yeah, it'll be a Fen. Fen TBF hybrid. That's not good. Oh, man, final 10 seconds. Here it is. I am super excited about this one. Let's go. Screenshot action. Oh, man. This is, oh, oh, completely disappeared. There he is. Oh, he's epic. Oh, he's huge and he's epic looking. Look at him. He looks amazing. Okay. Hold on. Bring all that stuff back. Let's get all this stuff off the ground. That's a lot of stuff. Okay. Can I ride you? I can already ride you. And you got the levels of the... You got level 100. Hmm. I don't know why you got level 100. Don't even care. Oh, look how big he is. Look how greedy he is. Okay, hold on. Before before something bad happens, not that anything bad would ever happen, can I extract essence from you? Because I really, really need essence. And this would be our way to get a bunch of different essences if we can make each one of these hybrid go, uh, guys. So let me see. Hold on. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Jump. No? What if I go like this? If I go like that. I don't think I'm getting anything out of it, but maybe I'm poking the wrong spot. I don't know. I'm not sure. It's definitely not giving me anything. Oh, it's not going to be. So we still can't make most of the hybrids because I can't get the essence. Hmm. All right, we'll figure that out. Let's go test this guy out. So this is a this is a poison, or this is a fen. Fen of adolescent dragon. So he's not even... It says adolescent. Do I need to grow in more? Hold on. There's not another stage past this, right? This is hopefully the last stage. I don't know. Or do I need to grow him from here? I don't know. I don't think we have to grow him from here. But this is so cool. All right. Make sure there's nothing crazy in here. Okay. Uh, there's a really cool Karkinos in there. But otherwise, just Karkinoses. Uh, we don't do a lot. What does right-click do? Does it do Torp? Well, I don't know. You can't do Torp on these guys, so it's not a really good test. Okay, come on. Uh, it's definitely not doing very much, but it's a Fen, so it's not really supposed to. I'm wondering if we can do Torp or other things, though. Uh, this was a bad idea, but hopefully we'll get a couple levels out of it at least. There you go. Just keep biting them all. Keep biting them. Just keep biting. Let's get a couple levels. Bite some more. There you go. Just keep biting him. We're about to get a kill. We're going to get a kill. There you go. Give me your levels. There you go. Plus, we'll get this shiny one eaten. We'll get uh, unlocked from it. OK. 
Okay. Couple levels. Boom. Here we go. 228. We're doing better. Alright, last one. I really like this spot up here with all this stuff. It's very cool looking. Alright, 400. There you go. We got a tech Ingram learned. Cool. Alright. Let's go ahead and pump those into melee as well. So let me see with an elemental guy, maybe. Uh, no Torpor, but lots of damage because it's the element that we can go against. Nice. We definitely wrecked him. Okay. Okay. Uh, oh, we're hurting for stamina now. Thunder? Oh, Thunder might be a bad one. Yeah, we don't do a lot of damage against Thunder. He didn't really wreck us either, though, so not bad. I don't know, man. Very, very cool. I'm definitely glad we did it. I had hoped for a little more damage, but it's not a big deal. I still want to do the other guys, and I want to see if maybe I just can't pull the essence because I'm hitting the wrong spot. You gotta make sure, you know, you gotta figure out where to put the needle, right? Gotta find the good vein, I guess. Uh, let me see, where is... There we go. Let's go land our buddy. Is that closed? It's closed right now. So here we go. First dragon. I'm very excited about the dragon, but I'm, I'm a little confused on how to get the essence still. There's still a couple things we have to make. Let me take a quick look at it. Oh, can I pick him up at least? It still says... That he's Fen adolescent. So does that mean he's got another stage? I don't know. I'm just not sure if he's got another stage though. Hmm. Alright. And it does say it says in their Discord that the sometimes the hitbox is hard to find on like pulling this stuff out. So I'm, we can definitely just keep poking and see if we get lucky, but so far no luck whatsoever. Yeah, definitely no luck. I don't know. We'll keep playing with it. All right, can I ball you up? We can. That's good news. Get all your stuff. Now, let me just take a quick look at because I'm going to show you what we were trying to make, why we're kind of stuck on this, but I'm going to end the video here. Like, comment, subscribe. Huge shout out to the patrons. Huge shout out to you for checking this video. I can make it to the end of the video. You're my MVP. I really do appreciate it. But over here inside of this thing, because I just want to finish that out before we do this, on side the, inside of this thing, there's some different things that we need essence for. Not the drakes. We can work on that, actually, in the next episode. Carcanos, no... Where are they? Reaper. So if like Reaper, we need Storm Essence. I can't get Storm Essence because I don't have anything that's a storm yet. All right. This one needs Glacial Essence. This one needs Fen Essence. This one needs Vapor Essence. Hmm. Yeah, and I just I can't get those things yet. Same with this one for all the Enforcers. Same thing. Basilisk. That one needs Vapor Essence and Fen Essence. All right. And then the Aquatic ones, the Tussos, same thing. Storm. Yeah, I can't make most of these yet. Vapor. So until I can figure out how to get these other essences, we're kind of stuck on that one, man. Oh, my God, don't turn admin on. All right, guys, I will see you in the next episode. Thank you so much.